A court-appointed guardian is charged with stealing from the elderly people she was supposed to be protecting. There are fears tonight there could be more victims. Our Kimberly Davis is outside District Attorney's Office in Center City on who started looking into this caregiver. Kimberly? Yuki, it was just a family member who was keeping a close eye on her uncle and her aunt's cash. And we're told that this woman allegedly might have stolen from even more victims. The DA's office is looking into that this evening. It all started with a fall. Heidi Austin tells us after her aunt fell, they tried to get in contact with this woman, the court appointed caregiver, 58 year old Gloria Byers. Finally, I texted her and she replied back that she was in Spain. At that point, um, that was a red flag for me. And after a Google search, Austin's concerns were validated. The first article that came up was a Portsmouth, Virginia um, person that was arrested for fraud. After finding that article, a quick background check showed that it was in fact the same Gloria Byers who was now responsible for not only Austin's aunt and uncle's care, but their bank accounts too. I was very surprised that a guardian could be appointed uh, without a background check. Thanks to Austin's investigative work, Byers is now behind bars and the Philadelphia District Attorney's Office is now prosecuting Byers. These are people who cannot handle their own their own accounts, their own money, that she was appointed to be their guardian. And instead of guarding, she used their estates and took what she could from it and has never accounted for where all that money went. The alleged thefts all happened within the last two years. The DA's office says if you notice any red flags, don't be afraid to speak up. Go back to the court and say they're not telling me anything about my family member. They're supposed to be guardian over them, yet we don't know what's happening. Byers is also accused of stealing valuables out of her clients' homes. We're told that she was responsible for 100 estates. We're live in Center City this evening. I'm Kimberly Davis, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Kim, thank you.